All right, so today's the first uh, trip out in Monterey. So this is the first trip out, venture out in cars. I'm gonna be riding shotgun since I don't live here and I don't have a car here. Uh, so there's a, you know, six or eight of us gonna go out and uh, drive around and I'm gonna bring you along and maybe set up the GoPros. We'll see, we'll see what kind of stuff we can capture. So I'm gonna head down there now. All right, I'll make everybody wait. I gotta show up like the cool guy. I had to get my camera gear. I was waiting for the people to finish the room. <laughs> so where are we going? We're going to Gordon McCall's garage. Oh yeah, it's, I forgot uh, about it. Yeah, yeah. Storage. I guess it's like a storage It's in place. town here, right? Yeah, uh -huh. about 15 minutes away from it. So we'll see what it is. I, I don't really know what to expect. But Let's do it. V6 or V8? Oh, nice. Oh. Rental. I want to see some burnout. Is this a uh, like enterprise uh, premium collection? National rental car premium selection. Nice. You mean I could have done this too, man? Interesting car stackers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How do you get them out? These are the valet, valet stackers. Yeah. yeah. Yep. All right. So loading up. I'm gonna be riding shotgun with Mike. You're gonna take it easy on me, right? Yeah. Nice and controlled, no crazy moves. And then Mike's son's Trevor's, it's Trevor's car, the S2000. Max's car. All right, so we're gonna go meet the guys and uh, head over to Gordon McCall's garage. But we're clearing codes first. So we're at uh, Gordon McCall's place. He's kind of giving us some history lessons on what's going on here and how he's, you know, acquired a lot of this memorabilia and stuff. Way cool. All right, so we're at uh, Scomas. Where the heck are we? It's Sa Sausalito. Yeah, we're at Sausalito. So, pretty cool. I haven't done a good job of uh, logging this, uh, this whole trip thing. So, we went, uh, we're about two and a half hours from Monterey. We went all the way up the coast, all the way up 101. <laughs> And now we, we just crossed the Golden Gate, which is back that way. And uh, there's, like, that's Alcatraz, I assume. Yeah, it's much, yeah. Yeah. So we got to feel for the people. Yeah. For me, no, sure. I'm not feeling the people today. I don't know how you do it, man. Like, I was driving, I was like, all right, I'm going to record a little something. Like, I, I talked for about five minutes to the camera, and I'm like, I'm yeah. <laughs> I could get down living in a little town like this, as long as I had a flat lot. Yeah. It's just a little bit overcast, but there it is. Golden Gate, I didn't catch it coming coming this way. In 2.1 miles, take exit 438 to merge onto C81 South toward 19th Avenue. It's pretty darn cool. I guess you get used to it if you see it all the time. decided rather than taking the highway this is the way we came in is to stay you know we stay on the coast so we get to see this kind of cool view all the way down through what's that uh where's the Mavericks it's um Half Moon Half Moon Bay and Pacifica yep through Pacifica Half Moon Bay and then back down to yeah. down to uh Monterey and it looks like we uh lost half our group so they're gonna be sitting on the parking lot on, yep. the, uh, on the 101, and we get to look at this. Screw them. It's not, it's not our fault, we're, we're smarter. That's correct. That's the cliff house we just passed behind us. And then this, I think, man, my uncle was telling me this is the largest city beach, I think. The longest or largest beach in a city in the world. the kind of beach you go to to uh, sunbathe though. Lots of people surfing. That's pretty cool. Alright, we made it back. 
So thanks to Max, we had a nice eight hour uh, ordeal. <laughs> I'm faking diarrhea tomorrow. <laughs> so I might come down with it. I'm down with the diarrhea injury. You, you just blew our plan. <laughs> no, <I'm> screwed. <laughs> so we're gonna go eat, eat again. This is what we do, you drive and eat. So tomorrow what we're gonna do, we're gonna do a, a eat, 30 minute out, eat, 30 minute back, Eat. Well, we got a snack while we're driving. Yep. And then sleep. And then oh, eat nap. again. Yeah, nap and eat again. <laughs> That's the plan. Yeah. You ready for that? Yeah. Only one nap. Yeah. Only one yeah. nap. Well, Matt naps in the car. I nap on the way in and the way out. <laughs> Day two. 19 hour drive. You ready for this? <laughs> Headed to. We go somewhere, we eat, we go somewhere else, we eat again. Yeah, we, come, we come back late, we eat again. I'm doing doing well though, I'm eating like a responsible human. So here the good news is we're starting to see some turns. The Quail Lodge was just behind us there. Lots of really famous stuff in this area. It's so cool. It's just interesting to see a different different scenery than what I'm used to. It makes me think winery. Why am I thinking that? Am I in the wrong place? That's north of San Francisco, not south, right? So, we're just kind of dealing with traffic, but we're getting some turns. Turns are always a good thing. So we royally screwed up this Monterey trip. Sorry, Max. But uh, Mike and I are driving back. We were in Santa Cruz getting some lunch. I'm like, let's go try Highway 9 up through uh, 30, I guess it's Highway 35. And yeah, we're in uh, probably the best driving roads I've ever seen in my life. So uh, needless to say, next year, we're, uh, we're gonna change up the route. We're actually like, 10 miles the other way driving up the coast the other day completely wasting our time Good and idea. we've driven like 75 miles straight just just getting back to san francisco of the most amazing roads you've ever seen in your life yep with this is the first car going by in the last five minutes yeah so anyway i'll show you what the roads look like here but we screwed this up big time so we were on this road now we're on this road. That's like 10 miles. We drove all the way up here, all the way to San Francisco. Go back out. There we go. Let's see. No. We could have been here. Even this, like back out the 280, is probably going to be pretty gnarly. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. And that doesn't show all, all of what, everything we've covered. Yeah, scroll out. Perfect. There we go. So all this down here. Yeah, but we were like, you know, they're 40 miles south. We're just carrying along a mountain range here. This isn't even a good road. Well, now we know. We're scouting it out for next year, people. So this is very, like any mountain roads, but relatively smooth for California anyway. Just awesome, typical mountain roads. And again, this is one of the straighter ones we've been on. <laughs> so, lesson learned. Next time, check the map, give it a shot. Even when I checked the map, I didn't think it was gonna be this good. And it's very clear that this is like car Disneyland because there are, we've seen hundreds and hundreds of sports cars. This is the kind of pavement we need. We don't have a whole heck of a lot of this in California. Check it out. Now we're behind a truck, obviously, but yeah, we found our spot. We're 30 minutes, 25 minutes south of San Francisco right now. Take a quarter mile, turn right onto California 35. About an hour and 20 minutes north of Monterey. And we've been up in the mountains. We're just coming down now. Which has been crazy. 
crazy turns the whole way. So what happens when the when the force pulls you back, your foot naturally comes off the gas. You have to keep your foot to the floor. Or the floor. 